দর্শক চট্টগ্রাম চ্যালেঞ্জার্স এর যারা ফ্যান আছেন এই মুহূর্তে আমাদের সঙ্গে যোগ দিয়েছেন আমাদের কারিবান পেইসার কেস্টে কুইলিয়ামস কেশি সো হাউ ইউ আর এনজয়িং দিস বিপিএল আর্লিয়ার ইউ প্লেড ফর রাজশাহী নাও ইন চট্টগ্রাম হাউ ইউ আর এনজয়িং ওভারঅল বিপিএল um at first i want to say thank god for being here i mean without him um, nothing is possible but it's it's been really really good i enjoy coming to bangladesh i enjoy coming here and playing cricket i mean i love the wicket say i love the challenges that it bring and, and what it, well, what do you know i'm playing for chatagan challengers you know but i mean on the serious side um i love coming here i really do and it's been a it's, it's been a pleasure to be honest in this team it feels like a family the management staff everybody has been gelling together well and it feels good it feels more than just a cricket team it feels like a family so uh, you traveled bangladesh for many times uh, after your own country did you feel that uh, it's your second home uh yes i feel like bangladesh is a second home to me i mean i mean a lot a lot of people here playing here for a couple of years and coming here at west indies as well so it feels like home it feel like that my second home and coming here every time i come here i meet new friends i meet new people and good people all the time so it's always a pleasure to come to bangladesh so uh, you are uh, player of chatrakam challengers the team is now in home soil so definitely it give extra inspiration for every player playing in front of the home crowd so how you are enjoying this um definitely it feels good it feels good to play in front of your home crowd and winning in front of your home crowd as well it's good when people come out to see you play as a home team and you give them something to shout about you give them something to say really about you know so it's a good feeling we're in a good space at the moment as i said earlier so it's just a matter of us to just continue to execute and doing what we have to do as a team and as a unit and gel together and do well so did you taste any special food of uh, chatagram <laughs> yeah um i had i had biryani i love biryani i mean i think it's a, it's a asian food yeah. and i love biryani i mean the first time i had it was in england and from then it's always good i love biryani so i had some biryani since i get here and it's awesome <laughs> So boy uh, if we again go back to a ground uh, uh, that is a uh, small part of a uh, game nowadays the sledging especially pace bowlers love to do it uh, so how you enjoy this part um to be honest to you i love i love sledging um i love when people give me that especially when they start it and i end up on the winning side like for example um the last game we played against um select thunder and when i walk into bat I mean every I think everybody know by now me and Fletcher are really close. So when Fletcher saw me walking and he he tapped his captain on the shoulder Mazadek and he was like give Abad Abadet what's his name Abadet? Yeah. Give Abadet the ball and let him just bowl straight Kes can't bat. So he was just staring. Abadet was just staring at me. So I was like why are you staring at me like that? Oh because I want to put a hole in your chest. That's what he said he's going to put a hole in my chest. So I was like why how are you going to do that? You have a gun on the field? And he's like look and you'll see. hurry up and come back so i was like just don't miss your length because if you miss your length you're going to go far that's what i told him so when i went to bat now when he bowled a couple balls at me i hit him straight down the ground hit him down the ground when i run past him i was like mate you're bowling two pace you're really slow that you're bowling at 135 and you're going to check the people with that on this slow wicket i said just don't miss your length suman hit him two a six and a four and after that i said wow that's a big hole and the guy ran over like he wants to fight mazadek run over before he try to calm it down he makes it looks like yo this this is going to be a problem and i just i just smile because i'm like why are these guys carrying on like this there's no reason for you to carry on like this if you can't sledge do not sledge you can't sledge and then when people sledge at you you want to fight it makes you look stupid and then what what pisses me off a bit more is because I was on YouTube yesterday yesterday or this morning and I saw something and the commentators on it was saying that I said something to him to get him upset. I didn't. And that that makes it look bad on me in a way as if I I made the guy and I said something bad to the guy. I didn't. So I'm just trying to clear the air now that it was nothing like that. If you know you can't sledge and you can't take it back, don't do it. Because when you sledge me and I'm in a comfortable position I get more confident and then I sledge back. Because don't think you're going to sledge me and I'm not going to sledge back. Because that's what that's how I gain confidence. You know so that's what really happened and Masadek I was really really surprised how he reacted and running over and like he want to fight and if Suhan wasn't there what would have happened or whatever. Because I mean I'm not going to come on a cricket field to fight. Bangladesh is a place I love. I'm not going to come here and cause a problem or make anybody think I'm a troublemaker. It was nothing like that. 
he run over, acted how he acted, probably he didn't hear what I have to say or anything like that. And you know, but that's how it is. That's cricket. So definitely, it's part of the game. So you yeah, definitely uh, forget this thing because it's uh, just uh, miscommunication. Yeah, it's miscommunication. I mean, I know Abedet. Abedet, um, I think. La, the first day I played here, he was in Rajshahi right King's team and he got injured at practice and he had to, you know, but I mean, that's how it is. It's cricket. You're going to get sledging and people might take it a bit farther than normal. For me, I just take it as a joke. If I really want to take it farther, I'll probably wait until after the game and go and I say, listen, I really didn't like the way you talk to me or whatever until, uh, but different than that, that's me. I love to have fun. Thank you so much. Definitely. Kashik Williams, Dekla Mamba